Today we will learn about examples related to perimeter of regular figures. Find the perimeter of a regular hexagon if the length of one of its sides is 6 cm. We know that a hexagon is a regular polygon made up of 6 equal length sides. Regular hexagon can be seen in a hive of bees. Since the perimeter of a regular polygon is equal to number of sides of the polygon multiplied by length of one side, so we can say that perimeter of a hexagon is equal to 6 multiplied by length of one side. Since the length of side is equal to 6 cm, so the perimeter of a hexagon is 6 multiplied by 6 cm is equal to 36 cm. Next example, the perimeter of a regular octagon is 368 cm. Find the length of its side. We know that for a regular polygon, perimeter of regular polygon is equal to number of sides of a polygon multiplied by length of sides. An octagon has 8 equal sides. So, we can say that perimeter of a regular octagon is equal to 8 multiplied by length of one side. In this way, the length of the side is equal to perimeter of an octagon divided by 8 is equal to 368 cm divided by 8 is equal to 46 cm. That is, the length of each side of the octagon is 46 cm. Next example. In the figure shown, a large square formed by joining four smaller squares with equal sides has perimeter of 40 cm. Find the length of the side of each square. In this example, we are given that the perimeter of large square ABCD is equal to 40 cm. We know that perimeter of a square is equal to 4 multiplied by length of one side. That is, Perimeter of square ABCD is equal to 4 multiplied by AB. Since we multiply the length of one side by 4, we get the perimeter of the square. So, we can say that dividing the perimeter of the square by 4, we get the length of one side. That is, AB is equal to perimeter of square ABCD divided by 4 is equal to 40 cm divided by 4 is equal to 10 cm. The length of each side of the square is the same. Therefore, the length of each side of square ABCD will be 10 cm. Now, by looking at the figure, we find that AB is equal to AP plus PB. Since a large square is made up of 4 squares with the same sides in the figure shown, we can say that AP is equal to PB. Hence, AB is equal to AP plus AP is equal to 2 multiplied by AP. In this way, AP is equal to AB divided by 2. Since AB is equal to 10 cm, hence AP is equal to 10 cm divided by 2 is equal to 5 cm. The sides of all the smaller squares are the same. So, we can say that the length of the side of each smaller square is 5 cm. In this way, the side of the larger square is 10 cm and the side of the smaller square is 5 cm. So today we learned about examples related to perimeter of regular figures.